Welcome back everybody to Tabletop Tactics. You join me, Chaos Sword Beard, and in today's battle we have a classic matchup as the mighty 4th Legion, the Iron Warriors, return to wage war against their arch nemesis, the Space Marines. Yes, that's right, clad in their jet black ceramites, the obsidian dragons, bolters raging, will try to deal with their traitorous brethren. But will it be enough? We'll have to find out, but let's take to the battlefield. Dragons take to the stage. They're finally descending into this battlefield maelstrom of war that is 10th edition, and I'm very excited to be running them today. Um, it's not quite the pure chaplain character list that I promised you. That will happen at one stage. I'm still planning it, just need to figure out exactly how I'm going to pull it off, but there will be a major chaplain list. This one does have two though, so <laughs> look at you lucky ducks. Um, characters wise then, I do have a Gravis Captain. He is going to be escorted by six aggressors today. I do quite like the Gravis Captain. Um, he does have that reduction of damage, which is very, very nice. The buffs that he gives to the units are sort of a bit by the by, but I think aggressors are pretty solid anyway. And the fact he can do, in being a captain, give a strategy for free, makes stuff like Overwatch a little bit more interesting on the aggressors, especially with the flame gauntlets that they are equipped with. I then have a bike chaplain. Senor Bonk has indeed returned to the battlefield. Um, he's going to be riding around with his Crozius and doing all that fun stuff. I've given him the enhancement, the, the um, Bolt of Discipline, because he is going to be in an Outrider squad, so suddenly getting that um, exploding fives in the Devastated Doctrine is really quite nice, especially with Catechism of Fire. Just gives you as many chances as possible to potentially get Devastating Wounds, which is very, very nice indeed, given the amount of firepower that Outriders can have. In the Outrider squad, I do have an Invader ATV, because you can take one now, which is really cool and that does have a multi-melter. I then have another chaplain. This is a foot chaplain, and he has the honor of a hemant, and he is going to be escorted by six blade guard. I genuinely think there's a real play for putting a chaplain in blade guard now. Giving them plus one to wound is really nasty, especially if you're doing something like blood angels. I'm not doing blood angels today, but suddenly the extra strength and the plus one to wound makes blade guard seriously nasty on the charge. So that's something to um, look out for for you blood angels fans. But today he is just a regular chaplain leading up regular blade guard. The honor of Hemant in the assault doctrine gives us plus two to his strength and attacks as well. So he'll be quite a blender in combat. That's the hope anyway. I do then have a six man unit of inceptors. These guys are quite interesting now. Obviously, Plasma's a bit different now in a world of like sort of higher toughness, but they can still deep strike within three, so they're really good at dealing with elite infantry. I then have two Invicta Warsuits. I really like these guys. They're fun still to infiltrate, and also the Invicta Fist is like strength 14 or something now, so they can be quite a good aggressive combat unit in the later stages of the game. So let's see if they stay alive long enough to prove that point. Then to round out the list, I have a regular Repulsor, which we'll be driving around with the Blade Guard inside. Um, has the Laz Talon and the double Laz Cannon, so that's very, very nice. And then I have a Repulsor Executioner with a heavy laser destroyer. I think anti-tank is crucial in this edition. So I think stuff like repulsors, um, land raiders, all the stuff that can take a bit more heavy ordnance on it have way more of a place now, especially if we live in a world we have to take a bit more of a varied list. So that's what I've tried to do. A little bit of everything. Some of the units we haven't yet seen in 10th edition. So I hope you enjoy and let's see how they perform when they land on the battlefield. Iron within, iron without, baby! Finally, the Iron Warriors are here for 10th edition and I am all about that iron life! I'm so excited to run them for the first time in the new studio in 10th edition. In the new studio? I don't know. But they're here. I've got some new units. It's all very exciting. It's being led by a warp smith. Who saw that one coming? This warpsmith has his warp hammer. I have also made him Mark of Zinch and given him the Eye of Zinch enhancement. So when he does his dark packs, he can get me some command points, potentially on the roll of a dice. He has some very large pets he'll be bringing to the battlefield, but we'll go over those in a little bit. The other character I've got is a master of possession. This guy is Mark of Slanesh, and I've given him the intoxicating elixir. So I have my five up, feel no pain and the other thing that, that does, which I can't remember off the top of my head. We then have a unit of five Chaos Terminators. The champion has a power fist, 
Um, one of them has a Reaper auto cannon. The rest of them have combi bolters and accursed weapons. Then we have some of my possessed. The possessed are going to be rocking around with the master position. There's 10 of them in total. The big 10. They are, of course, Mark of Slanesh as well, as they must be, because they are accompanying the Master of Possession. He does give them plus one to advance and charge, which is pretty sick. And they also have an icon of chaos, which is very nice for them indeed. Then we have all my mechanized stuff. We'll start off with a hell brute. Yes, I know it's a contempt to dreadnought, but some idiot took my rules away from me. So now I have to use them as a hell brute but that's fine because it looks cooler than the normal one anyway. Um, it has a twin auto cannon, a hell brute fist, and a heavy flamer built into said fist. A flame fist, how exciting. We've then got a lamb raider. Technically it's a Spartan, but some idiot took away the rules for my, my Spartan. So instead it's a lamb raider. Um, ignore all of the las cannons, there's only four, there's not eight. Uh, it's the pair of Soul Shatter Laz Cannons. I also have a Havoc Launcher on there, as well as a Combi Weapon and a Twin Heavy Bolter. I think that's everything that's in there. The Possessed and the Master Possession will be riding in the Land Raider onto battle, which is very exciting indeed. We then have a couple of Venom Crawlers, a pair of them, if you will, a pair of Venom Crawlers. I like these quite a lot. I've not actually played with them in 10th edition yet, but I'm excited to see what they do. Oh, I always have some obliterators, two obliterators, two obliterators, pair of obliterators. Um, they are Mark of Chaos Undivided, so they get to reroll one. It's very exciting for them. I forgot to mention all the marks and everything else, but mo most, things, most things are undivided. Pretty much everything, actually. So they get to reroll ones to hit when they do their dark pants. That's nice for them. And finally, introducing the big boy. The biggest boy I could find. It's the Corn Lord of Skulls, aka the Iron Lord of Skulls. He's here. He's been painted up beautifully by my friend James at Poseidon. Thank you very much for painting him for me. He is truly a sight to behold. He's a very big boy. He has a Gore Storm cannon, a Hades Gatling cannon, and a Great Cleaver of Corn. Of course, he is Mark of Corn because he's a Corn Lord of Skulls. But I'm very, very, very excited to run him today. The um, Warpsmith can accompany him and keep him nice and healthy whilst he goes around cleaving fools, which is more about that. It's very exciting indeed. The list is 2,000 points directly on my iron schnoz. Let's get into the mission and lay waste to these filthy Space Marines. Today's mission is Supply Drop. At the start of the battle, players randomly determine two objective markers in No Man's Land to be the Alpha and Omega objectives. At the start of Battle Round 4, the Alpha objective is removed. At the start of Battle Round 5, all objective markers in No Man's Land except the Omega objective are removed. Players score victory points for each objective marker they control in No Man's Land at the end of their command phase as follows. 5 victory points for each objective marker in Battle Rounds 2 and 3, 8 victory points for each objective marker in Battle Round 4, and 15 victory points for the objective marker in Battle Round 5. The player going second instead scores at the end of their turn in Battle Round 5. Each player also determines if they are playing fixed or tactical for their secondary missions. <laughs> oh, 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 oh. He's as big as a house. He is as big as a house. I'm going to need to give him a cool name. No stupid name for him because he's big and uh, scary and very cool. So not Big John. He, no, not Big John. He does. He deserves. He deserves a cool name. So I'll think on it. Nice. Or maybe someone in the comments can give him a cool name, and I'll pick one if I deem it's worth. Maybe he has to earn a name today. Like if I he does something. I think he might. So he gets like a title. Okay. Like cleaver of tanks or. Decimator of bikes. Like whatever he does, he gets like a little title. Okay. And it changes. Just keep adding them on, yeah. like a Necron Lord. <laughs> yeah. Okay. So, a couple of things to mention. Uh, my obliterators are in deep strike. My yes. terminators are in deep strike. Five of my possessed <laughs> are in the Lamb Raider because some idiot decided to remove Spartans from 40k. So uh, I couldn't fit all 10 and the Master Possession in my Land Raider. So it's now a unit of five plus Master Possession. And then in there, that's the other five. Yes. And they are, instead of Mark of Sinesh, 
uh, undivided. Very well. In ter- for, for the purposes of their um, dark, team. dark pact. Yes. That is everything. Terminators I've mentioned are in Deep Strike. Um, you have stuff in Deep Strike? Yeah, my Inceptors are up in the sky! And my Blade Guard and Chaplain are in the Repulsor. Regular Repulsor, not the ex- Executioner variant. Wonderful. In terms of the board, we've got a couple of craters. Everything else is a ruin. And we'll tell you when we get into it, like this section here is like one big ruin. Yeah. In terms of the mission for Supply Drop, the <laughs> Alpha objective is number three over there. So in about round four, that will so be that removed guy's... from the game. The Omega objective is number four, which is bang in the middle. So in about around five, that's the only one that will remain, which I'm very excited I'm, about. I'm very pleased that your battle plan can just be park Mr. Big Man onto the central objective. It's not called Mr. Big Man. He's as yet unnamed as Cornwall of Skulls. <laughs> Why don't you roll first? Oh, well, thank you. In this game. We're off to a flying start. A f- Ooh! A fiving a start. A two. Very well. You get to go first, sir. Do indeed. Come towards my corn lord of skulls. Tell on. Oh. Full space marines. Um, card wise, Drew, secure no man's land and assassination, which is quite interesting. I've also done my scout move with the infu- not the infiltrators. They are infiltrators technically. Um, the Invicta tactical warsuits. So they've shuffled forwards. I'm going to be a bit aggressive with them. I think is my plan. So we'll see if it comes to fruition. Um, then in terms of oath of moment. Controversially, mm. I've picked the Land Raider. Okay. Um, my thinking is, and I don't think I, I don't think I physically can kill Mister TBD. I mean, you, you can, maybe not in a turn though. Oh, that's the thing, and I feel like it's more prudent to try and deal with this, the Land Raider first with my guns, try and pop it open, then put all my firepower into something that's just going to probably shrug it off and just cleave. We'll come to him later. He's a problem for future turns. That's future James's problem yes. to deal with. Um, so I'm making my bed and I'll probably get stabbed repeatedly while I'm in it. Um, in terms of combat doctrine, I'm going for Devastator Doctrine just for moving and shooting shenanigans. I think that's all to report from the command phase. Let's okay. do some movement. The Invicta Warsuit, having done a scout move, is keen to move again. So, move forwards. <laughs> I'm facing him this way so you can see his lovely face, but obviously you wouldn't be able to rotate. The bikes are advancing because they have turbo boost, so can. So they're doing what they love to do best, which is drift and drive and have a lovely time. I had great plans for this unit, but they rolled a one on their advance. So they're just going to stay behind the line of sight because there's not much to gain from moving them into the ruin just yet. They'll do that later. Target acquired. Advancing over to this way, the repulsor parks just behind this building so we can see some things, but slightly awkward for the giant Lord of Skulls to see him. Well, I foolishly assumed that the big cannon on the Lord of Skulls had a much greater range, so actually I'm, it's more prudent for me to just stay further back because I'll get a way better line of sight of what I want to shoot, and I'm still relatively safe, and Mr. Beard has been very kind in letting me address my terrible tactical acumen. Shooting phase has begun! Um, I've done all the little pittery pattery from the Repulsor Executioner into the Spartan. Land Raider. Land Raider. Land Raider. Um, so far unscathed. Because <laughs> you did, what was the C- what was the strat you did? I enacted my infernal rights. Infernal rights. So I spent the CP so the AP was reduced by one. And then... Well, that's very really nice. You do have quite a big Boomba Cannon on there, which I, I do and enjoy. Oh, the old OT moment is quite useful. Mm. Let's get onto the big Boomba Cannon now. Okay. Heavy Laser Destroyer! Boomba! Oh, it's twice. Nice. <laughs> Heavy Laser Destroyer! OT moment! Oh. Heavy Laser Destroyer! Two wounds! Two wounds? Yes. These are AP4 but down to AP2 because of my Inferno right on my cover. Ah! Oh, one does go through! One goes through. You've pierced my hull. D6 plus four. Okay. Seven. No, five. five. <laughs> the Invicta Warsuit has, again, done its little shots off camera. Still unscathed. Yeah. I was hoping I might like clink away a couple of bits. I think you chipped some of the paint off. You've probably, yeah. you've probably uh, unneatened a hazard stripe. Yeah. Thing. And the guy on top's furious. That's why he's climbing out. He's got his paintbrush. He's, like, no, he's, doing, he's enacting the infernal rights on his little... Oh, heart. yeah, that's true. Techno tablet. Techno tablet. Mm. Techno tablet. iPad's 7,000. 
<laughs> now for the auto cannon. Uh, obviously, it is OT Moti, so um, lots of rerolls for days. To wound you. Oh, come on. You're winning on sixes? We're winning on five. Oh! Because it's strength nine. So it's that is two be. wounds with the auto cannon. AP is what? Minus one normally. Oh. Ah! Does go through. Three damage! Three! Oh. Good, good, good. There we go! Too many crickets. I'm down to eight wounds. Very well. Mm. Mm. So an interesting little combo, this. Ooh. So I put Bolt of Discipline on the bike chaplain because he then gives exploding fives or sustained hits fives uh, when he in the Devastator Doctrine to the bikes because he is within 12 of the um, Land Raider so can elect it to be his Catechism of Fire target. Nice. Um, so these are all the hits I've got through but what's interesting, I'm winning on sixes here because of Oath of Mountain Comics you re-roll but because of Catechism of Fire you are, um, de oh, they're devastating wounds. Nice. So it's quite spicy that. Yeah, very Let's see nice. how we get on. Um, so a few sixes in there to start with, obviously I can re-roll everything because of the Oath of Moment. Okay, I get a couple more there. That is not half bad against a Land Raider with bolt rifles. So that is one, two, three, four, five mortal wounds. I've only got three wounds left. Gripe for a multi-melter. <laughs> so the multi-melter, yep. Um, does get the sustain from Bolt of Discipline as well, as far as I'm aware. So that's always quite interesting. Um, to wound you, um, will be fives and sixes. Um, that is the one. I can reroll, obviously. Oh. That is just the one wound. Now, interestingly, yeah. that will, that that will be a devastating devastate. wound. Because <laughs> the ATV is in the bike's unit. I don't get a save. So there's no save. Ah, Are you in half range? range? Um, I don't believe I'm in half range because it's just 18. Uh, oh, yeah. yeah. So you've got three wounds left. Oh! No! Oh! Oh! <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh the no! <laughs> the chapter's already shot with the other one. No, oh, he's got two wounds <laughs> left! Oh, well, there you go. Well, at least it's the combo you can use. Normally, it's probably a bit more effective. <laughs> I've made a startling discovery. <laughs> My regular repulsor has a hand to slay a missile. <sighs> and it has a very important keyword. Indirect fire. Oh. The dream lives! <laughs> <laughs> Still rock one, but we'll come to that in a minute. Um, to start with, um, the heavy bolt and all the other guns are going into the Hellbro over here because they give good auras, so I want to try and bring him down. Um, so far, the heavy bolt has done nothing. The Gatling cannon stuff is out of range. Um, but the Laz Talon and the Laz cannons are going into um, the Hellbro. Now, I have a bone to pick with this date card. Oh. On the model, the Laz Talon has one barrel. Yes. The twin Laz cannon has two barrels. The Laz Talon has two shots, and the twin Laz cannon has one. Really? <laughs> Crazy. I get the twin link, that's how they work, but I mean, it just feels strange. It's okay. It's I okay. feel strange sometimes. It's strange. I feel strange many times. That's okay. Right, the twin Laz Cannon. There's a hit. Oh. The twin Laz Cannon! It's a wound! What is this? It's just my Hellbrute. Into your Hellbrute, yeah. Minus three on minus the Laz Cannon. Three. Minus three? Minus two, you will be getting cover, I believe. Yes! It does go through. It does go through. D6 plus one damage. <laughs> Three damage! Okay, acceptable. Two shots from the Laz Talon. Stop it! Oh. I have indeed stopped it. <laughs> <laughs> um, um, yeah, it doesn't. Yeah. Right, the Hunter Slayer missile. Oh, you know, onwards and upwards! Go. Onwards and upwards! Now I can get my oath of moment. The guy on his little, little data <laughs> stage just like, what is this? What is happening? This is not okay. <laughs> ah! <laughs> Something's coming for us! Two wounds? Oh! <laughs> What's the minus? I don't know, I've never shot one before! Minus three! Minus three, so it, this will be... Minus one? I have a three up save. <laughs> oh. Oh. <laughs> Come on, pilot with your tablet, you can do it! Shields up! Oh, yeah, he's done it! He's closed the tone like... Yeah. Right. Last chance saloon, eh? Um, I was hoping to put this firefire into the hell route, um, but needs must. I'm gonna try and shoot at you. Okay. Land Raider. Um, so these are all the stubbers. Uh-huh. Um, right, I have got... Oath Moment is still up, so I can obviously do my various rerolls. Okay. Very nice. Lots of hit. <sighs> can you pierce my hull? Only <laughs> round. I think not! Yeah! I've pierced Oh, you pierced twice. me twice! <laughs> There's no AP here. Okay. Well, yeah. But, but. <laughs> okay. <Right. laughs> the Heavy Mountain! 
You're enraging the possessed inside. Yeah, that's getting uh, furious. Very angry. Rolling. That is a wound. Minus one normally, but you have your, your, your dude with his little, his buttons. What gun's this? Heavy bolter. Oh! oh. <laughs> I thought it was a one. Right. One more gun. Pushing my luck a bit. Oh, dude, you can do this. You can do it. <laughs> right. <laughs> oh. It's a moment. Okay. Fives? Yep. Oh. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Minus one to you, dude. I am winning! <laughs> oh! <laughs> He's done it! He lives! Okay, what a legend! <laughs> <laughs> desperate times, desperate measures. Um, the evictor's going to attempt to charge onto the um, Lamb Raider. Now, you might be like, why didn't you reroll the damage with the Moment Because of the mission roll, it's 2 CP. I don't have that much CP. Yeah. So I've got no rerolls here either. Yeah. But we have faith in the Invictor. He's done it! He's, He's in! in! Ah! <laughs> yes! Oh, yes! <laughs> 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 I, just, I, I, just, I just won't stop, will I? Let's keep pulling out chances out of nowhere. Right. Spending a CP on tank shot. Okay. So my weapon is strength 14. Yes. So your tough is 12. Yes. So I get to roll 16 dice. Is that it? I need two five ups. Is that all you've got? And the Invictor War suit sort of just there's a r running punch. This punch is through, through I mean, the Land Raider. There's quite a few holes in it at this point. Yeah, so. I, mean, I kind of shot it with my entire army. <laughs> um, see how we get on. Okay. <laughs> oh, okay, I think. Okay, there's. You got it. There just, just, only just. Two. just it's only two. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That is two more wins. Do you explode? I certainly wow. hope so. <laughs> Oh, oh, close. But it is destroyed. Now, I've got six <laughs> models inside, <laughs> including my master of possession. I, oh. Oh. I cast, I cast die. No, they're all fine. They're all fine. Absolutely <laughs> furious. <laughs> he's run towards it, punched over in the hatch, and he's seen inside all the possessed being like, bleh, bleh, and he's holding onto his arm. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> Well, that's my turn. Yeah, you, you, you ripped you, them open. You've, you've got out further away because yes. I, I could, in theory, if you'd got out close to me and you'd so wanted to, I could have then piled in and fought you. Which, which is, is very, which very is nice. Pretty cool. Yeah. yeah. Makes tank shock and stuff like dreadnoughts or quite choppy units. It's very cool. Very interesting. Yeah. Which is needlessly cool. Yes. Um, but that is my turn. Okay. Um, I did get Secure No Man's Land, so that's good for me. You did. Um, didn't get Assassination, but I am going to discard it. Goodbye. It's fine. Um, which is nice for me. Um, yeah, all right, turn that. I, Operation Bring Down the Land Raider was a success. You brought it down just about. Just about. Literally, just about. <laughs> On the, the final it's, dice roll. They're quite hard to get through. Yeah, it's so a great, great example. Oh, a moment. And to a laser destroyer, a hunter slayer missile, yeah. or an Invictor war suit. Also, that um, combo with the catches and fires is pretty naughty. Um, so that's one to keep an eye on. Wait um, I said bueno. Oh, bueno. I thought you said yeah. wait. I thought you were going to drop like a wait, hot bit of knowledge. No. But, I'm yeah. going to drop a hot um, bit of Lord of Skulls in a minute. Though. Yeah, that's going to be cool. Can't wait. Right. Allow me to retort. Left. Sorry? You said right. Oh, okay. I'm messing with your head! I, <laughs> I've drawn Area Denial and I've also drawn Assassination. Now, sadly, Area Denial is a no bueno for this turn because I can't, I can't get Holy Within 6 even with my Lord of Skulls because he cannot fit Holy Within 6 no, in the centre. He is larger than 6! Chunky <laughs> boy. Uh, but I'll think about keeping that for later, but I do also have Assassinate. I do have a chaplain I'd like Ooh. to rip into pieces. You dare! I do dare. You dare! Stop it! I do you. dare. You do! <laughs> no, no! <laughs> The other thing I dare to do is is dream, but also to infuse my Lord of Skulls with the Master of Mechanisms. Ooh! Warp Smith. Warp Smith. So he would ordinarily heal up, but he doesn't have any wounds to heal, but he does now get plus one to hit, which means his ballistic skill is two. Electric Boogaloo. Oh, no. <laughs> we will begin with a Lord of Skulls. And the Warp Smith will follow close behind. My pair of Venom Crawlers will be moving next. He has to climb over this wall, so only moves 10. And this one, aye, is here to unleash its venomous death. 
The Hoot and Heckin' Hellbrute will also move up six to unleash his aura of good tidings. Operation Rip the Chaplain to Pieces is in effect. No! So the possessed are moving forwards. No! Everyone's like, why do you have possessed and iron warriors? It doesn't really go with the fluff. Turns out they're full of techno virus and they, they've all just gone wrong. So they're just primed to explode. And the War Master's like, you go over there and explode into our enemies. And they're like, <laughs> Time for the shooting phase. Yes, indeed. I'm going to begin with my Master of Possession. Oh, are you? Yes, I am. Oh, no. the, the, I, I'm being very, very good and not going straight into the Lord of Skulls. Because with <laughs> being very reserved, <laughs> my right of possession, <laughs> aka my staff, uh, it has precision. No, it and doesn't. And I have assassinate. No. I've got chaplains to possess. No, you don't. So I'm going to focus Witchfire, your chaplain, with my Master of Possession. Um, for the shooting phase, I, ha I am going to do uh, dark pats on everything. I'm going to roll for my leadership, see if I lose any mortal wounds at the end of the phase, and I'll come back to report. I have picked sustained, sustained. for the purposes of this. Oh, ready to be possessed? <laughs> Are you ready? Oh. Yeah. You didn't matter. Well, I missed you, uh, and I've hit you once. It was very, very underwhelming. Javelin. Oh, I should also mention that I did my sacrificial dagger. Okay. I've splained one. You splained so one of your possessed? One of my possessors taken a mortal. Do you reckon they get multiple spleens when they get possessed? No. Okay. I actually lose them. Um, <laughs> so this will be, because I'm plus one to hit and wound, I'll be wounding you on twos. Oh no. Luckily, yes. So it's minus the re he. For a save. Oh, yes. oh <laughs> Come fight me! <laughs> Venom Crawler is next. Yes. I'm going to have to start dealing with these bikes because they are very large. Surprisingly tough, actually. Yeah. I'm probably going to charge both my units are possessed him, but then you've Ooh. got, you've got CP to, to, to interrupt. It's all very stressful. So I'm going to try and start cutting them down a bit with some, with some firepower. So if I'm Venom Crawler over there on the far side, I'm going to unleash my excruciating It's a cannons. crawler. Um, this one is uh, Chaos Undivided, so I get reroll ones to hit. That's with nice. My dark pact and also sustained. Sustained. Reroll the Come ones. On. I'm a sustained. Oh. oh, I've got two twos, so that's sad. That is sad. That's fine. Uh, I'll be winning you on threes because these are strength. Yeah, good strength. Goodbye. Oh. Limey. Uh oh. Okay, I've wounded you three times. These are minus one, but there is cover, so minus none. I uh, save two, one goes through. What is the damage? Damage DOS! You have cut a bike in half! Very well. The other Venom Crawler is going to do exactly the same thing. Very well. Here we go. Excruciate! Oh! Sustained. <laughs> Threes to wound you. BAM! Uh, four wounds. Four wounds. I save all of those ones. BAM! Hellbrute. Yes. Twin auto cannon into the mush of your Invictor. Invictor war suits yes. into the heavily armoured frame. Exactly. <laughs> um, sustained and lethal hits because of his aura on himself. That's cool. Oh, I can reroll one. Yeah, Chaos Undivided. He's, uh, Chaos Undivided. <laughs> <laughs> Woo! He's just, he's just loading in the old shell. That was a warning yeah. shot. There you go. Two there hits. Go. Uh, I'll be winning on threes. It's strength nine. It's two wounds! Minus one! Eat it! Ah! Eat it! I eat both! Oh, six damage. Oh. Serves him right for not covering up in the case with the pilot, it's really, isn't it? <laughs> it is time. Oh, here we go! To unleash the ultimate weapon of the Iron Warriors. It's the Corn Lord of Skulls. Corn Lord of Skulls. Baby. The Iron Lord of Skulls. Exactly. Annoyingly, you have to run its corn. Nice. Makes sense because normally it's covered in corn stuff, but I took them all off. To be fair, if you build a giant axe for something, put loads of skulls on it and make it into a giant chainsaw as well, you're probably are quite a big fan of corn. It's hard to get around the yeah. facts. Yeah. It's yeah. not like he's got some sort of magic stick or he's really smelly. So he's not yeah. Nurgle or Zinch, definitely, so yeah. definitely corn. And we were also discussing what the tanks are. I, my prediction is that the four tanks each have a demon within them or maybe a... Oh, a, just they're like a, a contained demons. demon. Yeah, yeah they're, they're in Ooh, they're sealed, that's cool. Sealed shut. Maybe they're on a little treadmill and powering the... Um... <laughs> I voted for goop. Goop. Goop, goop canisters. Oh. Yeah, it's, uh, the souls of the dead that you fire out your cannon. Here's what's happening. So my Gatling cannon... My Gatling, sorry, Hades Gatling Cannon is going to go into your bikes down here. Very well. And my Demon Gore Cannon is going to fire into your pathetic, puny Invicta Warsuit down yeah, there. Yeah, that's fair. I'm going to be turning him into gore. I contemplated doing Armour Contempt 
on the bikes, but I've decided not to because I am getting cover and I want to try and save it for maybe an interrupt or something cool later. I understand. Okay. He has plus one to hit because of the warp smith. He <laughs> has lethal hits and sustained oh, because nice. the hell brute's within six inches of him. Oh. Are you ready? No. What do you want me to do first? The bikes or? It's up to you, my man. Bikes first. Yeah. Hades Gatling Cannon! Hades Gatling Cannon! Oh, that's gone well. I didn't miss you! Oh, I did miss you once. Chaos it's Undivided? Oh, gone. no, he has to be corn. He can't. He's not Chaos Undivided, is he? So he can't reroll his ones. No. But no. I, do, I do get sustained. That's nice. Only one. Sustained is built into that, that gun, actually. <laughs> <interestingly>. <laughs> uh, I'll be wounding you on three. So strength eight. Yes! Well, not bad. That? Not bad at all. So it's three, six, Eight wounds. How appropriate. Uh, How appropriate you for the Corn Lord of Skulls. Um, you do get cover, it'll be a minus one. Oh, it's not gone particularly well. Oh, that's... he's loving his life. No, that damage two? Damage two. So a bike is dead. Yes. Another bike. Yes. And a bike half. Yes. So three bikes. Yes. Very nicely done. Next, we'll move on to the Demon Gore Cannon into the Victor War Super. Yes, indeed. Who's again? <laughs> Sustained. 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 It's into me old Invictor, isn't it? You including your lethal hits as well. <gasps> Two automatic wounds. Oh no. I mean, it is strength fourteen, so I'll be wounding you on twos. Your strength, uh, toughness seven? Toughness eight. So oh, it's three. three. Made a mind a bit of difference. I don't mind. Uh, that's five wounds at minus four. Um, well, I don't well, have a seven. Minus th oh, no, you don't get. Uh, but, uh, but, uh, I tell you what, technically you do it get would be a six up because my, my, my butt five, is. You say. What? Five. 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 Yes. I save one, but what, what is the damage? <laughs> Ready? Yep. The, oh. Well, five, uh, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. On uh, the button! 30, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 90, 20 wounds! <laughs> Does he explode or <laughs> he just melted into goo parts? Yay! He goes, oh, it's only my men! <laughs> no. uh, it is only D3. D3. Oh, you could kill one of my possessed here. Onto the possessed that I've recently I mean, even could, spleened? Anyway, even, even... Even, even, even Stevens. Oh, you did kill him! Finish one off! The, the, the Very one nice. with the spleen is And onto the healthy um, squad with their spleens intact. Yeah. It's just the one. Just the one. Just the one. Right. He's cool. lost his spleen now. Explosion! <laughs> Yay! It's the charge phase. Yes, indeed. Charge phase it is. We're going to start with the possessed over here into your unit of... I should point out on that unit of bikes is that I kill the bucket front and put the rest of the wounds on the ATV. Nice. But just so you're aware, if you're like, why is there more bikes around? That's why. That is for why. I need a five. You do indeed! I don't know why he says he has one wound left, he has two wounds left. Come kill me! Five! Yes! Nicely That's done! Two fives, one more than they need it. <sighs> now this squad over here actually need uh, a seven away, but they need a six because the master possession gives them plus one to That's the cool, chargings. that. Nice little combo. Eh. <laughs> That's exactly what I needed. Precise. No Spot less. on. Oh, oh, oh. It's time for the fight phase. <laughs> claws bed. Uh, well, I say claws. They're basically, so, so the fluff with my possessed is that they've been infused. They're basically mm. experiments. Like tendrils. They were legionnaires. And all of like the warp smiths and the dark magi and stuff have been like infusing them with dark mm -hmm. powers. Some of them have gone have gone well and turned into obliterators. Others, such as them, are basically like, oh, that's not going to go well. They just get thrown into battle. They just explode. Nice. Is essentially. I like this. Works. I like this a lot. Yeah. Um, so because they are undivided, chaos undivided, I have uh, used a command point for profane zeal, so I can reroll my hits and my wounds. Very nice. Yes. Um, I've also done for my dark packs uh, sustained. Sustained. And at the end of the shooting phase, I didn't fail any of my leadership tests, so nothing else took any mortal wounds. Um, I'm opting to do Armour of Contempt. Oh, you know. I was going to do something cool, only Death Does Duty end, but realistically, there's only two that could actually fight even when they die, because mm. they're not all in range. Yeah. So I'm going to try and hopefully keep them alive. Okay. Good luck to you. Thanks. But good luck to me. I need good to, to you. get through all of these bikes to get to the juicy chaplain in the centre. Can you do it? Nearly in valour! Your soul will be mine! Oh. Okay. I only missed you once! Uh, That's crazy! That's the best run I've ever done. I only got old, one sustain though. I hope the old armor of contempt comes that into play in a minute. <laughs> How, what a funny roll! Ha 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 ha! I missed you once with my reroll. 
but I had a sustain, so I've hit you all the times. Very well. I have devastating wounds here because uh, I am a possessed. Oh no. Um, because I've made my dark pact. So I'll be wounding you. Uh, what's your toughness? Five. I'm wounding you on four. Very well. I want lots of sixes, essentially. Now, do I just be greedy? Ooh. Do I be a greedy, a greedy goose? No, because that's actually quite a good roll. That's a good roll. I'm going to say thank you very much to the dice gods. You've got quite a few more wounds in there. Yeah. So I've, you've got three you, more you, wounds you, so far. They're one damage each or two damage? Damage DOS. So there's six actually six wounds. mortal wounds. Oh, I flung myself too hard. <laughs> no, okay. That's oh, a lot of wounds, well. though. It's a lot of wounds. That's a three. Doesn't so look good. two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, thirteen. Unlucky for some. Two, four, six, eight, ten, ten, twelve, you say? Thirteen. Oh, no. Oh, no. Right, three upsides. That's not bad. That's gone it's well. Not bad at That's all. That's gone very well. Now that does mean mm. the ATV is dead because I had to get wounds to him. That is another bike that is then slain. Okay. You then do six mortal wounds. I do. So that is then another like bike and a half. Okay. That's not bad. Got through a lot. Yeah. Well done. <laughs> that was alright. Save it over there. <laughs> Next unit. Oh. So I forgot that my unit of possessed here have a six up feel no pain because of the master of possession. So you mean to tell me there might be another one? Maybe. So if I can oh! roll six here, <laughs> we'll come back to life. No, no, he is dead. dead he is forever. dead. He is Never mind. dead. That's okay. Okay, so I've done my dark pact again, so I get sustained hits five. <laughs> Ooh, here we they go. Are, they are slinchy. And... Yes. You have 15 wounds to get through here. I do. Which also, that smart. sustained hits on fives, not five additional hits for your sustained. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. It's sustained five. <laughs> it's not sustained five. It's gone well though! Not bad. Missed you a few times, but I've got one, two, three, four, five, six! Sustained six? Yeah, so that's tw uh, 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 35 additional, right? Is that how the maths works? No, no. no. What did I say? One, two, six. three, four, five, six. What? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Yep. <laughs> Oh, come on, come on, come on, Vote Chapman! Right, if these can all be sixes, that would be marvellous. Uh, fours to wound you. Oh, I've thrown one away. Oh, that's a good start. That's a reasonable amount of sixes there. Okay. Okay. All right. Okay. okay. I mean, I've, I've failed to wound you a few times. Oh! That, that, is, that is two, four, six, eight mortal wounds. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, and then six normal wounds in a dish. Oh, four of these, I believe that's the unit. Yeah. Hang on. <laughs> I think. Oh, we are fine. I, the chaplain's alive. Is the he? squad is decimated. Okay, but I think the chaplain's alive. We'll double check that. But oh no, <laughs> Captain Bonk's still here. No, <laughs> uh, the chaplain is alive on three wounds remaining. Yeah. So is my master of possession. Yes! <laughs> Your men are dead, nearly on valour. It's time for you to perish. I do not fear you, you cheap conjurer. They sound very similar. Maybe yeah. They're, <laughs> they're all space marines. They all yeah, sound like space Palpatine. Space. It's fine. Um, okay, right. Let's all simmer down for a second. I am going to use my sacrificial dagger again, because it is once per phase. So I'm going to spleen another one of my spleen another one. And it will take a mortal wound. But now I'm going to be hitting you on twos and wounding you on twos. Oh, no. Because it's strength six. Oh, no. Sustain fives in effect because he's slanesh. Okay. So, yeah, you, I... Yes. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Two's to wound. Oh, no. Oh, baby. <gasps> ah, oh. So one of them's devastating. So, so you've got D3... Three mortal wounds. D3 mortal wounds and four ordinary wounds. It is AP1, the staff of possession, I'm but... I'm is still in effect. Get three up. Okay, right. comes down to your devastating wound. How many wounds you got left? Three. Three left. Five or six will do it. <laughs> <laughs> I summoned the dark power to put you down nearly on valor. Oh, Bob is a one. It oh, takes more alive. than that to kill me, demon. <laughs> <laughs> My chap didn't fight back. Oh, he's got two wounds left, right? You got two wounds left? Two yeah. wounds left. Hits you. Doesn't quite hit you all the time. Okay. No. Whoa, he's just. He's quite. He's, he's, he's been taking a bit of a battery. Yeah. yeah. It's forced to wound you. You got top of six. Uh. 
That is only just the one wound. Just the one? He's quite tired. <laughs> is there an AP here? A minus one. Minus one, you say? Oh, okay. What's the damage? Two. Okay. Go no pain. Uh. No of possession. Oh, he strikes you down a possessed. <laughs> I did roll for the mortal wound I lost uh, for yes. my dark pack, so this one is actually... Oh, dealt yes. with. <laughs> I just forgot to show you guys that I made the charge with my venom claws earlier. We're too excited. We're too excited. So I'm going to do both of these at the same time. They've both got the same dark pack. They've both got... Sustain. Sustain. Yes. Lovely, lovely, lovely. So I have missed you. Oh, I, do, I am... Chaos undivided divided on these guys. Okay. Not, Not. Too uh, shabby. And couple sustained. Should have done lethal hits, really. You'd be ruin ruining me on fives here? Yes. Yes. Should have done lethal hits. Idiot! Am I still doing the business? <gasps> One, two, three, four, five. We keep going. Five wounds. These are minus. Minus, minus one. Minus one. Minus one. Oh, okay, what's the damage? Damage two. You kill him. Is he dead? Yeah, he's got, he's got three up save. Yeah. Minus one, two, he's dead. Does he explode? Does he explode? Yay! Why is he blowing up in my area, please? Okay. I must have loaded all the invictors with dynamite. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> um, only D3. I say only D3. So this pretty is cool. So On many. the first Venom Crawler. 100% success rate for explosions. Three. Three? Was, my first, that was that one. Owie. On the other one. Just the one. Okay. Now, what I did realise is that I should have done these separately because when one of these destroys a uh, enemy unit, I have one to my attacks. So I'll just roll a d6, shall I? So one, two, three, it's the one. Uh, the yeah, bottom one. Nice. Four, five, six, it's the other one. I don't know why, while I'm rolling on the table. Uh, but the one f closest to you has one additional attack. It's got seven, which is lucky for him. He's eating his soul. Yes. It is actually called Soul Eater. Ah, oh, there you go! <laughs> <laughs> Not a bad turn. That's great. Not bad at all. I love this bow round one. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Nearly got him. Nearly. Nearly got him, but not quite for assassination. So he will live to fight another battle round. <laughs> Possibly. <laughs> yes. Uh, I am going to keep assassination. I'm going to get rid of very denial um, because I can't quite. I don't think. You know, it's not. No, it's no good. But I'll get another command point, which is nice. For yes. Me. I have a hundred percent success rate for exploding enemy vehicles. Fantastic. So I concede. <laughs> <laughs> Going out on a high. Um, yes. Uh, I don't believe you're going to get anything on the primary. In your no. Next turn, so yeah. No I've, primary for I've, me. I've, I've, I've stopped the primary scoring. Our home objectives matter not. Exactly. In this game. Now time for battle round two. I feel I can hear the assault doctrine coming on. Ooh. <laughs> Turn two for the Zillion Dragons. Oath of Moment is going on the Lord of Skulls. A big boy. He has to start being dealt with, and he's quite large and scary. You've witnessed the potency. Yes. Mm. Um, I then am going for the assault doctrine. Today. Oh. Because I've got some some exciting things inside my repulsor that I want to get over to here and do the murders. Um, cards wise, kind of at odds with what I want to do on the battlefield in terms of killing stuff. I've got engage on fronts and cleanse. Engage is quite possible. I don't really want to have to be doing actions on objectives right now. I need to bring my guns to bear. Yeah. But I do have some deep striking potential, so maybe I might have a little plan. The chaplain begrudgingly falls back, for he has heard the call of his captain and the captain's aggressors who have advanced forward, for the assault doctrine has been called. Oath of moment has been declared, and the repulsor executioner has work to do. The chaplain and the blade guard depart from the repulsor and then roll a six on the advance. So they are very much ready to bring justice and death to the traitorous brethren before them. <laughs> now, I would like to have been more aggressive with these guys and use their meteoric descent, but I really need engaging all fronts because I'm not getting any primary, so I'm trying to hide them for future turns. The great task has begun. <laughs> Bring it down! Um, so the moment is on um, the giant steel destructor, um, but in, so far from the pit of battery, the heavy belters, the stubbers, and all the rest of it from the repulsor execution, I have done but a single win. I did re-roll some six. I got some sixes though, which was cool on the old stubber. So that was a, the humble stubber has done its first wound. Um, the rest of the shooting, 
is a slight split. The rocket pod is going into the Venom Crawler, just to see if I get lucky. Yep. But the Heavy Laser Destroyer and the Gatling Cannon are going into the Lord of Skulls. Because the Gatling Cannon does have devastating wounds. So we have Oath of, Oath of Moment that could be quite useful. Uh, yeah. Yep, yep, yeah. Yep, 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 We'll do the rocket pod, okay? Here, just to see how that gets on. I got three shots off camera. That's very nice. Um, this is into. Oh, well, I missed with twice too, so that's always good. To wound your venom crawler. No, it is not a wound. So good job we showed you that. That was fun. Um, <laughs> the Gatling cannon then will trace before the left. He calls it his web. Yeah. Web. Eh, eh, web do you? <laughs> no rockets for you. Um, the Gatling cannon then into the Grim's Dark Future. <laughs> um, not too bad. There's no sustain or anything. If uh, I could get that again, that would be nice. I prefer it be... if you didn't. Right, okay. To be fair, he's done better than I thought he would have done with newly painted model syndrome with such an enormous model. Yes, this is very true. <laughs> right. Okay, well, I'm going to reroll all of those because I'm wounding you on sixes anyway. You are. And I need them because they're mortal wounds. Yes. Not one. But you are traced! <laughs> Importantly, you are traced. I am. Well, do you know what this calls for? What? Heavy laser destroyer! Ah! Hits you twice. Ugh. Heavy laser destroyer! Mm. Wounds you twice. Mm. Two wounds of the laser destroyer is I minus think. four! Oh. You will be getting cover though, so minus three. I'll be getting my demon save! Pass one. That's Pass fine. One. That's good. It's fine. D6 plus four damage. No. <gasps> ah, you did it again! I blew it! I blew it off! <laughs> On to my next tank. On um, again, I did the heavy bolt actually into the venom crawler. I did two bits of damage. You absolutely so not did. Too shabby there. The rest of my guns, however, are going into the Lord of Skulls. We can start with his Gatling cannon. Also devastating wounds. Okay. OT Moti. Devastating barrage. I think you get lots of sixes on the hittings. Uh huh. I need it on the woundings, you see. Y yes. Well. Two there. Two so far. Two so far. Very good, very good, very good. Two, 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 go through, so two more wounds. Sixteen right. wounds left, now. which is uh, eight twice, which means he's now indestructible for the rest <laughs> of the game. <laughs> two last talent shots. Anti-damage one plus. Right now, we'll be with you on, because your toughness like 13, is that, aren't you? Ooh. So we'll be you on fives of the last talent. Ah. Oh. Oti oh. moti. Uh. Oh. A single wound with the last talent, it is at minus three. But... Oh, see ya. No, it does go through. It does go through. D6 plus one! Three. Okay, right. All is not lost. Laser weapons are, uh, 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 yes. Let me down over here. The twin Laz cannon, which has one shot. So you've done three, three, three wounds in total so far, yeah? Rolling, because we're both a moment. Okay. <laughs> I appear to be in a spot called Bother. <laughs> I'm thoroughly enjoying myself. Yeah, this has been great. I'm really enjoying this game. It's like every single turn, something mental happens yeah. immediately. It's like, oh, did you want to kill my chaplain? Have another one. <laughs> yeah. uh, we will start with the aggressors um, charging into the possessed. Okay. Uh, I should point out the reason why I'm not doing any shooting is because I don't really want to elongate my charges because the plasma executioners and kind of want to keep them hidden. And then that's why. And everyone else has advanced and done all the other bits. So understandable. The aggressors are in. I'll move them in, in a moment. Now chaplain number two. Okay. And the blade guard. Can't yep. really fail. But good job too, because they get a three. I think it's because they advance so quickly, they just sort of like, whew, yeah. Whew, oh, here yeah. we go. Oh, well, here we go. I like to think he just swings the croziest round and oh. like, oh, we're ready to go. Right, let me move this stuff in, then I'll contain my excitement slightly. Right. <laughs> Look at this. Here we go. It's like the drop site massacre <laughs> yeah. or something. Well, it's better be a massacre. Um, so a couple of things to note here. A, just because it's cool, my chaplain leading the blade guard is currently strength eight. So that's fun. Um, because of honor vehement, so that's fine. It's his whole doctrine, and he's got seven attacks. So because of that, in his honor, I'm going to allow him to honor the chapter, which is one CP. Doesn't really help him because he's already plus one to wound. That's just fun. But then it'll be minus two with yes. the Crozius, yes. which is very fun. But what is also very cool, to start the fight phase, because my captain can do this. Well, potentially, I can then do honor the chapter again on the aggressors if I so choose, because he can do <laughs> stratagem for free, even if it's already been used. Speaking of stratagems, I'm going to enact my eternal hate very well onto this squad here. So on a four plus, they can fight upon their demise. 
It's time for the Sword of the Imperium. Okay. The Blade Guard! Now, I can reroll ones. Good thing, too. It's a lot of ones. Of that. It's an inordinate amount of ones. Some of them ones. That's very handy. Um, get rid of the two. Sixes don't do anything. I, I thought about one. doing uh, interrupting, but um, I don't quite have enough potency to make it oh, work. Okay. I don't think. Yes, because they're quite, all quite chunky. I'll be wounding you aggressors on five. It's up a six, no less. Right, I will be wounding you here on fours because my chaplain is in the squad, so I'm giving him plus one to wound, which is very nice. Nice! Quite well. No, mm. can't reroll wounds. Uh huh. It's reasonable. It's a reasonable uh, effort from the blade guard. Uh, Shame sixes don't do anything because that uh, would be have been horrid. Uh, um, but that is three, six, nine. That's because of honour the chapter minus three. But you have your five of them. Minus three. Yes. My <laughs> demon save. Come on, possessed. Well, what's the damage? Two. Right. So that's one. Well, one was on two wounds. One, two, and three are dead. Very good Kill going. Kill three. Now, the question on everyone's lips is, do they fight upon their death? Well, I need to fight with my chaplain first. But you do that first. Let's quickly do that, because it's part of the same unit and also it's Okay. It's very cool. So, mm -hmm. so here we get some. He hits you all the times. Oh, come on, chaplain. Chappy! Oh. So, he's got your strength eight, but I'll be wounding you on twos here. Uh, and a good thing too. Good thing two. Four, five, six, seven wounds. Is that all minus you've got? Minus two because we're on the chapter. Oh, Is that all you've got? Chaplains! <laughs> good roll! Yep, em, yep, em, yep, em, yep. They two are. Two damage all a pop. Okay. Now, do they fight on death? You might be able to retaliate. I certainly hope so. Much, much anger. My eternal hatred knows no bounds. I mean, it knows two, three pieces three bits of bounce. Bounce. So two of them can strike you back. Yes. Which, you know what, I'm going to do immediately. Yeah, that's cool. Okay. Um, I, I, I'm enacting my guys. dark pact. They can't die any more than they already have, so. Yeah, go, go crazy. Let's see. Uh, we're going to go for... Sustained. Sustained. Reroll them ones for my dark pact. One sustained. Basically, um, I'll be wounding you on three. Your toughest four. Toughest correct? four on the yeah, blade guard. Well, it's four wounds. Uh, oh, actually, it's three wounds and, and two six. mortal wounds. Oh, very nice. Well, mm -hmm. actually, well, that's one dead, but we'll come back to them in a minute. Okay. AP here. AP. <laughs> one. Oh, very well. They save three, but one does go through. So you do t kill two blade guards, because that'd be two damage. All right, then you did all right, all right. four more wounds, didn't you? Uh, so you killed two blade guards. Oh, yeah, that's all right. Pretty good. <laughs> the aggressors now. Um, and I'm going to do the cool thing with the captain of that, because you can do rights of battle. I can do a stratagem that's already been used. <laughs> and I can do it for free. So they're going to have honour the chapter. Everyone's honouring the chapter. Stop honouring the chapter. I feel very honoured about my chapter. You can't honor take that away from me. Honour the obsidian dragons. Honour the obsidian dragons by punching some possessed in the face of power fists. This way to do it. The way to do it. Um, so the aggressors into the possessed. They will be hitting on fours. Were you going to say something? Oh, to mention as well. That's a very good point, actually. I, when you, you knocked over one of the dice, and I thought you had two sixes. You only had one six. It was two mortal wounds, I not wish. two mortally wounding wounds. So only one blade guy's dead. No, 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 no. Power fists! Oh, that's gone quite well. No, um, no uh, rerolls or sustained. They are hitting your fours, though, so actually dropped quite a lot. Good. I will be wounding on twos here, however. Oh, bum. <laughs> to wound you. Um, I do drop, so that is five wounds from the Power Fists. Um, these will be at minus three because of honour the chapter. Right, this will be on my demon saves. My demon, demon saves. saves! Saves the demons. Right, so I've failed. How was the damage? Two. Okay, so you've done four, so I need to do eight, feel no pains. Yes, so you'll have to do them separately. Why? Because one might tank enough to take different wounds. I hate doing this. Though. I know, but you have to do it! I hate it! So I have to do three to. at a time, right? Um, yes. Uh, what's the damage on them, James? Two. So four at a time. One's dead. Well, two are dead. Wait, hang on a minute. They're three wounds. How many yeah, wounds? Yeah, so that one's, that one's dead and that extra damage is wasted. Is wasted. And then the other one. Yes. Oh, wow. See ya. The other one is also dead. Yes. Right. It's two dead. dead, dead, dead. Two dead, 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 dead. One left. The captain himself. No! His power fist! Hits you all the time. Back foul demon. <laughs> we'll also be winning on twos because of honor the chapter. He's got a power fist and a sword, doesn't he? Yeah, he gets an extra tax with the sword. It's kind of cool. Oh, is that how yeah, that works? Yeah, that's kind of cool. Oh, that's yeah, cool. That's fun. It's fun for him. <laughs> uh, that was uh, four wounds. Four wounds? Yeah. 
Um, well, I have to do these separate, right? Or because saves. I have a. Uh, so oh, these... they are the same invulnerable saves. There you go. Yeah, that makes it easier. Mm. Oh. Plus two of them. Oh. Plus the damage. Two. Damage two? So just yes. roll four. What? You can, you can roll these all at the same time? My goodness. Oh, goodness. Uh, hang on a minute. But he gives the. If he's leading a unit, they get feel no pain. But it happens all at the same time. Yeah. Shut up, Beard! Um, okay, so he that possessed has taken all the wounds from his Dark Master. Nice. Mm. So what you mean to tell me is that the extra tax on the Relic Blade could now finish off your man. They could. They could indeed. They could. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> Pity twice. Manage uh -huh. your tax. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. I believe I was your toughness you master possession. This is toughness four. I wound you twice. Ooh. These are minus... Minus, minus three, because of... Minus three? Damage two! Yeah. Oh, he's dead! Is he dead? Does he's he literally dead. punches you, them all you out do, and then just... You do still get the film, okay? Oh, he's still dead! <laughs> <laughs> oh, <laughs> you killed him! You imagine the captains kill the possessors, like, you will never finish. God, <laughs> just him as he goes into like a fort. <laughs> That's my turn! Well done, you! That was good. That was a lot of excitement. Slaughter. Really cool that you can do the multi strap <coughs> on the odd captains. That's nice. Bit of nice, that is. Um, cool, I, I did get engaged on France because I've had to hide my interceptors behind a wall. Yep. It's funny, I can't really see them anymore, but you can very much see them. It's like I'm playing mind games. Go away. Um, I'm getting rid of cleanse because I don't want to have to do any actions. I want to shoot and fight. You've cleansed the battlefield of my filthy possessed. This is true, but you have reinforcements. On yes. Route. And I have things to clear of the battlefield of my own. Okay. Here we go! Okay. <laughs> Reinforcements to come, a few things to do first of all. Um, I failed Battleshock over there on my Venom Crawler, hence the Battle uh, Shock token, which are available for you to pre-order right now at TerribleTactics.tv for flush, flush shop. Get yours now! Pre-order! And they'll be shipped to you at some point when they are manufactured. They're made out of solid metal! <laughs> Quality knows no bounds. Um, the only other thing to do is my Warpsmith is going to do the Healy Dealy oh, yeah, and the plus one Ballistic on my Lord of Skulls. Gone Ballistic. He regains one wound. Well, it's better than none. That is better than none. So he's up to 14. Could have lost a wound. Round number, which makes me feel better. Yeah, that's nice. Yeah. Um, apart from that, there's nothing else to worry about right now, except I got Bring It Down as my second secondary. Yes. As well as Assassinate. Oh, it's no. not the bestest, but it's not certainly not I the mean, worst. My oh, Chaplin is sort of, the bike Chaplin is out in the wind right now. Oh, he, he will die. I just don't want to focus too much on him, you see. Yeah, that's fair. But before we get on the streaky phase, we must get on to the movement. Yes. <laughs> Hello, boys! <laughs> <laughs> the Warpsmith will once again keep up with his giant friend. That has 14 moves. Hellbrute will move up to get line of sight onto the aggressors. Venom Crawler! <laughs> and this Venom Crawler... Hey! We'll come over here. Still want that objective. So, I will keep it. The first of the deep striking units... No! And the final piece of the puzzle... Blah! Blah, 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 blah. Bam! Shooting face! Oh, yeah, you're dead God, now! Right in the, Devastating! Right in the solar plexus. My Terminator squad has freshly arrived from the warp. It's now going to unleash its hell rounds. <laughs> the combi weapons are going to fire into your aggressors and the Reaper autocannon will reap your chaplain asunder. Yeah, because you were going to do the combi at the chaplain, but he is mounted. It's really annoying. <laughs> so the anti-infantry does not apply. Yeah, I mean, the Reaper autocannon might sort him out. I'll come back to the Reaper autocannon okay. though. So four shots, actually, forgive me. It's eight shots, because it's rapid fire range, basically. Ooh. Into your aggressors. Aggressors. See if I can get round their toughness. Uh. Now, uh, I am a despoiler, so I'm rerolling my hit roll, because I made a dark pact, being undivided. It's sustained, I'm rerolling once. See ya. See ya. Okay, so I've missed a couple of times. I can reroll this one into a six. <gasps> but I do get one sustained. One sustained. So I need fours here, essentially, uh. for mortal wounding. Oh, I didn't re-roll my twos. Oh, that's a terrible roll. It's not ideal, that, is it? Why? <laughs> One mortal wound. Um, how many twos did I get? I think I rolled. I think I rolled. I reckon you got a couple. Roll, roll, roll. Two. I think I got two. Two. Okay. No. Can I? Can I wound you? No. One mortal wound. What a giant bunch of clowns they are. Okay. Well, okay. Because all of the dark energy's gone into this reaper. Yeah. <laughs> 
That's what's happened. It might do well, I'm done! <laughs> Sustained. Actually, I'll re-roll that two as well. Is this still a two? <laughs> but that is five hits. Oh no! Pleasant. Uh, these are strength seven, so I'll be wounding you on threes. Oh, why am I rolling like an idiot? Okay, now, they're devastating wounds, so it is one mortal wound, and three saves. One mortal Minus wound. one. One mortal wound and three saves. You want to make all of them. Dun, 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 dun. What's the damage on it? One. Oh. <laughs> oh, you swine! Oh, no, wait! Oh, no, you get cover. Damn you! Why is he alive? Oh, he is, isn't he? Yeah. <laughs> oh. Nearly on Valor lives! Oh. It's fine. I didn't want to kill him anyway. I wanted to save him. For you, the want him to, you want him to have an excruciating death. Obviously. That's what I see. I'm moving on to the excruciator gammon. Another dark pack, an act. Did and the excruciated <laughs> cannon into your Nerion Valor. Yep. Looking for lots of sixes yep. for sustained. I mean, I can't can't be too upset. That's with a good that. roll. Can't be too upset with that. Now we'll be threes to wound you. Yep. And I swear to God, if he's not dead after this, I'm going to be oh, not great. <laughs> it's only three wounds. <laughs> 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 yep. Ah, oh, he's definitely yeah, dead! Yeah, die, <laughs> wow, he's taken the full brunt of the Iron Warriors he's, today, he's isn't he? Got, does, does he sort of, I don't know, does he explode in his soul? No, he's just, he finally, he falls. Hellbrute next, he yes. can just about see the aggressors, <laughs> so he's going to fight next before anything happens to him. Um, <laughs> sustained unlethal hits on his dark pack. Nice! I have hit you once, I can re-roll the one, for he is undivided. And he gets sustained! He does get sustained. Three out of two. That's nice. Like two um, for one, but Oh, that's and it. one's an automatic wound. Because it's lethal. Lovely! Uh, I'll be wounding you on... Therese! <gasps> Devastating wounds or anything? No, it's twin linked. Uh, but it's three wounds. It's only minus one, but it is damage three. Oh, we'll be getting, getting cover. Yeah. One does go through. One's just dead. One is just blah, 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 uh, uh, It's time for the Lord of Skulls. Uh. The Hades Gatling Cannon is going to fire into the aggressors over here. Yep. The temptation to fire at something that's already Gatling Cannon me is, is quite high. <laughs> yeah, you were just, saying that. Was like, you, that's not a knife. This is a <laughs> knife. <laughs> a Gatling Cannon. Uh, but the Demon Gore Cannon is going to fire into this yeah. um, repulsor down here because I need to bring it down. In my head, the repulsor has shot the heavy laser destroyer. It's like, oh, that'd be a kill. And it's just gone like, bang. Yeah. And then like, <laughs> it's immediately <laughs> like pop smoke. <laughs> like quick, I have a phone in a CP on popping smoke. It does give me cover and minus one to hit. So that's handy for maybe that's, keeping that's me alive. That's very nice. Um, I'm going to do, uh, so I'm, I'm doing sustained and lethal hits because of the Hellbrute being nearby and yes. granting me his great- Damn wisdom. you Hellbrute! Uh, so I would be hitting you on threes because I've got plus one to hit, but you've got minus one with your... Um... Oh, the aggressors are normal if this is your Gatling Cannon. Oh, that's a good Should point. Should be hitting them well, on that's good because that was a lot of twos. Yeah. That was going to make me very sad and very, very angry. Um, I've got sustained, so two sustained and two uh, lethal hits, so I've got two wounds already. Very nice. I'll be wounding you, I tell you, on threes because it's strength eight. Well, not bad well, that. well, well. That is three, six, seven, eight, nine. What Put the AP here? on the line. The <laughs> AP is two, and you will see. So I'll be getting four uh, up here because I am in the cover. These aggressors mean nothing to me, yes. Not bad. Okay. What is the damage of your thing? Damage two. You killed two aggressors. Two dead. Two are slain. That's better than none dead. Right. <laughs> and now it's time for the G demon gore cannon. How many attacks do I get? One. Marvellous. <laughs> Can I hit you? Yes. You do hit me. Thankfully. <laughs> right, <laughs> me. We're only on threes. Yep. <sighs> it's two command points to reroll. Oh, god damn it. <sighs> That's fine. Venom crawler number two. <sighs> More excruciating action coming into these aggressors down here. No! They're not the ideal target, but I need to keep trying to remove them, them from my You've done a pretty good job so far. You're, Thank you. You're getting them down. Thank you. Uh, sustained. Once again. Not bad. I am undivided. You are. Undivided is, is I think it's the best option. Yeah, because we were on those ones. Can you still get all your extra little goodies? Oh, that's not very well. That's, that's quite nice, that. That's a... Uh, 
sustained. That's three sustained, more. Sustained. It is fours to wound you, however, because you are T. I am indeed. <laughs> Tough cookie. That's a good roll. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good. That is very good. Pretty good. Um, it's uh, eight. Eight, you say? Oh, it really hurt my leg. <laughs> <laughs> there, um... Hit it too hard, James. <laughs> minus one here, yeah. Dings. Yeah, it's minus one. Yep. That's also quite good. So damage. Very sad. That's uh, damage two. One is alive on a wound. As in, one takes two damage. <laughs> Take it right back off. <laughs> <laughs> okay, James, here we go. No. Not had the best shooting phase, but now it's time for the Dark Gods to redeem themselves upon me. So, my obliterators are the last unit to shoot. Yep. My Wartsmith annoyingly can't target anything, so I can't do my cool Eye of Zinch to get some command points thing, because I can't shoot anything. However, exactly. over here, I'm going for a bit of a stretch. I'm going stretch to... Stretch goal. Yes. My flesh metal guns are going to morph into their focus malice profile and then fire it into your big tank over there in an attempt to bring it down. Yeah, I um, have contempt for the dark gods, so I'm going to put on contempt on it. So I minus one to your AP. I understand. And I have my smoke, but you are also doing something. I'm I doing my profane zeal so I can reroll my hits and my wounds before I am chaos undivided. <sighs> okay. Done sustained. Yep. How oh. many shots do I get? Because you, you're potentially like damage six, aren't you? Because it's melted two. Yeah. <laughs> Depends on how many shots I get. Oh, okay. Two D three shots. Huh. All right. It's, that, it's not the best, but it's fine. Okay. Okay. I can't kill. How you. many was it? Three. Well, you still have sustained. Still have sustained. sustained. You only need sustained. three wounds to go through. Three right, takes it. I got one six. Got eight, I six eight, you can reroll the one because your chaos under. Oh, actually, we're both going to meet you on fours, right? Yeah. Yes. Suffer and suck attach. All right, okay, so it's three hits. And you just need three to go through. <laughs> <laughs> Why is everything, everything in this game so, <laughs> so stressful? <laughs> we you on fours. Yep. Re-rolling. Oh my god. Re-rolling, re-rolling, re-rolling. Re -rolling. No, I've wounded him every single time, Daisy. <laughs> Hang on, hang on, I'm gonna go and ready, James. James, you need to fail every single one of nice these Nice and days. supple. <laughs> Oh no, did you pass one? Yes, I passed two! I passed two! You! Why do you hate me so much? Well, it is 12 damage, to be fair. No, I passed, passed two because of Armour Contempt. I'm very sorry. Still six damage. Still six damage? Don't talk to me. <laughs> all I want to do is blow stuff up with my guns. Yeah. That's all I want to do. But now I have to do it with my fists and stuff. Yeah, iron life, you're living. My, I'm all about that iron, iron life, life, baby. Right, the obliterator's going to charge into your tank and finish it off. Yep. Ready? I'm going to roll a 12. Yep. Well, that's a 6, which doesn't even get me in. The Terminators will charge into your aggressors. Yes. That's a 5. It's worse than the last one. But... The Lord of Skulls oh. into your blade guard. Oh, oh he's, he's very in. <laughs> okay. Here we go. Here we go. We make up for that shooting fade, <laughs> aren't we? Hey. So, the Lord of Skulls is going to unleash <laughs> his great cleaver of corn. Before he does, <laughs> it's like for tank shock. Big rig, big rig. So I've got and then he shouts, block this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you filthy casual. Well, yeah, I think that's six. That's, that's definitely six mortal wounds. I mean, it would be a lot more. It is exactly six, isn't it? A lot more. Because it goes, goes off on, on fours, right? Fives. Fives? Exactly six. One, two, three. Oh, that's cool. You maxed it, baby. Well done, Pow! me. You, you run two over on the way in. All right. It's, it's also good. worth mentioning that the, the, the guy charged. Oh, the Venom Crawler oh, charged the venom. over there, yeah. yeah. We'll talk about it in a minute. He did indeed. So I've done my Dark Pact again. Oh, for the, in, in the last one, the only one that failed his leadership for Dark <laughs> Pact <laughs> was this Venom Crawler over here again, I think. So he's taken three <laughs> ah! mortal wounds. The, the Dark Gods do not like spiders. Um, so I'm going to go for the sweep with my Great Cleaver for yep. 15 attacks. These are sustained. It is Mark of Corn, so sustained is on five. For what it's worth, I'm putting my shields up. Okay, it's I don't care. Fair, that's fair. I don't care. I might care. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Right. Oh! Um, so I am hitting you on twos still because yep. um, it does. Quite a lot of sustain in there. Does, it, does that just keep going? I presume so. Is it sort of my next command phase? Is it ballistic skill just hits? Hits. 
<laughs> right, so I've rolled a couple of ones, but I do have one, two, three, four, five additional hits. Ooh. Ooh. Sustain this. <laughs> oh, no. Um, if strength eights so would be twos to wound you. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. <laughs> oh, dear, indeed. Oh, no. Oh. Uh, three, six, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Four, six, eight. That's eight times two. Two, four, six, eight, ten, eleven. 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Now, I put my shields up so I can reroll once. Okay. Yeah. That is cocked. I'll reroll that. That's quite a good roll, actually. It's okay. Yeah. I, I mean, what is your damage? That's, that's actually cool. It's damage two. Damage two. Mm. Right. Okay. So they've done okay, despite being much smaller. Okay, okay. Damage two. So that's yeah. Blade Guard dead. Okay. Blade Guard dead. Yeah. And another Blade Guard dead. Okay. So between the Tank Shock and the Sweep, you have killed all the Blade Guard. But the Chaplain's alive? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> My Chaplain gets a stroke. back. He's very Chaplain y. Very sad that he's not getting his plus one to kill. It would be very funny. But yeah. he's going to be winning on five. It's still technically the Assault Doctrine is active my next command phase. Yeah. So I'm still getting my Honor Vehement bonuses. Now, also... Down to the sheer butchery that just occurred here. Because the Lord of Skulls destroyed a unit in the fight phase, like my plow through the enemy ability yes. comes in, which means that he, the tank, and the aggressor will have to take a battle shot test. Yeah. The aggressor's failed. <laughs> they did. They just, they just saw their <laughs> mates get cut into several pieces. <laughs> but whereas the chap was just like, <laughs> oh, I love also, it. the Venom Crawler and the Tank have also done the fightings. Oh yes, you oh, managed yeah. to do two <laughs> wounds on my yeah. Venom Crawler with your tank. Um, uh, he, he did four damage. He did four in return. Eye for an eye, sort of. Yes. Uh, right. Chaplin. Hits you all the time. So. Oh, baby. To wound you. I can get that again. Mm. He fives, right? Yes. Three wounds. Three wounds? <laughs> <laughs> what's, the, what's the AP? Minus one. Minus one. Nah. <laughs> Two go through. Yeah, four damage. Four. Grr, grr. <laughs> you <laughs> ten wounds. Uh, Come on, Chaplin. <laughs> well, well, well. Yes. Ington. Hey, really well, Ington. Um, that's the end of the turn. Ups and downs. <laughs> peaks and troughs. A little bit of everything. Um, so uh, I'm going to keep bringing it down. Yeah, fair enough. Because there's, there's less to deal with now, and also the tanks need to be dealt with. So I'll keep yeah. that for next turn. I did get assassination for killing your, finally, killing your chaplain. Yeah. So that's nice. Um, they're battle shocked, so they may or may not hold that objective in the next turn. Well, yeah, at least do another test yeah. in my turn. Yeah. Um, yes, very interesting stuff. I don't even know what the scores are. I I don't don't I. I, I just, all, I, all I know is my mission still stands as I need to, I need to kill the Lord of Scars. Command phase with the dragons. Dreamer cards. Got overwhelming force and deploy teleport Homer. Normally I'm like, oh, deploy teleport Homer. But I actually happen to be in your deployments over once. The perfect so, plan. It's almost like I planned it. Yeah. I didn't. Um, <laughs> so that'll be fun. Um, so they will probably go and do that. Overwhelming is going on the big boy in the center. Because needs must. And also it does help me because if I do kill that, I get overwhelming force. So mm. it's kind mm. of a win-win there. Mm. I then have lots of other things I need to deal with, but mm. we'll just have to figure that out. Mm. <laughs> Shooting phase for yes. the dragons. A um, little bit of a summary. Um, the defensive array and the heavy bolt have already fired. So far, I've done nothing. The heavy bolt went over here and the defensive array went there. I was just going to see if I can get cheeky and try and finish him off because he's got a couple of wounds, but no dice. Not today. Um, the Gatling cannon and the Laz stuff is all going to this one because it gets me overwhelming force and prevents you holding it in your turn, which is quite crucial. Five wounds left over there? Yeah, and I just okay. don't trust if I do the split, I'm not going to be a clown. Ooh. We'll do a tracer Gatling cannon. Okay. Um, well, I've hit you quite well. You have. And it is devastating wounds. It is. Which is nice for me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> two mortal wounds. Mm -hmm. And then two regular wounds. No AP. Two regs. Yeah. Blup. So he's got two wounds left. Two left. Okay, right. <sighs> the last cannon. Misses. The last talon. <laughs> <laughs> Hits you twice. Uh huh. That was Alan. Wounds you once. Minus three. Demon save. Oh, minus yeah. three. Oh, yeah, yeah, I, I, oh, I'm not out of the woods yet because you've got two wounds remaining. Yeah. Oh, it is D6 plus one. Oh, is this? So I can't do what I normally do. And... Good. Good thing, too. Good job I did do the Gatling Cannon. It doesn't explode, but it is dead. 
Oh, so get some points for everyone falls. Okay, I'll have a little lie down now and we'll come back for something else. Executioner time now, and everything is shooting at <laughs> the Lord of Skulls. It must be brought down. Uh -huh. um, so the defensive array, heavy bolt and all the rest of it has gone into it. Um, I did one bit of damage with the stubbers, but I have done, because 18 attacks with the defensive array, um, I've got five wounds, because of both the moment and all the rest of it, through to your Lord of Skulls. Obviously okay. there's no AP here, it's just like storm bolt and chipping, chipping damage. Chipping. Oh, you've done two more wounds. Two more wounds. Right. How many has he got left? Seven. Seven. Right. <laughs> Time for my Gatling cannon. Oh, this is devastating wounds. Obviously, you're rolling because of Oath of Moment. Why? The oh, moment's so lame. It is. Mainly because you have to spend so much time re-rolling it. Yeah, maybe. it's a little bit, a little bit, a little bit tedious. Um, quite potent. Yeah. But tedious. Because you're only be wounding you on sixes here. Uh huh. There's two already. Three. Four, four mortal oh. wounds. Oh. You've got three left! Three left. Three wounds left! The heavy laser destroyer. Ah! Right. Now, interestingly, you're below half strength. Yeah. So I add one to my hit roll. Oh, lovely. So I hit you twice. Uh -huh. To wound you. Oh, for the moment. One wound! One singular wound! What's the strength? 14. No, it's 16, in fact. <laughs> What's the AP? Four. Four? I have a demon save, don't I? Do I have a demon save? I have a demon save. I have a demon save. <laughs> Come on, if there was ever a time. Demon save! Oh, hmm. oh I can't even re-roll it. But <laughs> Oh, no. Oh, no. It's D6 plus four. Oh, it's already dead. It is dead. Does it explode? Come on, man. Come on! Oh, oh so nearly it wings! Oh, oh it's I mean, he got through quite far, considering he's so new. Good work. I've well done, little mate. So I did the last bit of shooting, which was, of course, the flame storm gauntlets, because the plasma dudes are doing deploy teleporting, because, of did. course. Um, I did one bit of damage to your you Terminators. Um, I am now going to try and charge you with um, both the aggressors and the um, chaplain. The aggressors will go first. OK. I did also spend a CP on profane zeal. Yes! Uh, no, infernal rights to Because you did want to keep them. Keep them alive. The aggressors do not make it. OK. The chaplain. No, please. Oh, no. The chaplain is in. <laughs> oh, no. uh, let me consult my book of stratagems because there's a couple of things I can do here. Mm. It's like out of sequence, I didn't, I'm still getting used to all the new rules. So I'm doing adaptive strategy on the um, chaplain. I am in tactical doctrine for this turn, hence why I was able to fall back over here. So I'm putting the chaplain back into dev, not dev doctrine, assault doctrine. Okay. So he gets his honor vehement again, which is enhancement. Yeah. So he gives him seven attacks, making his strength eight, and he becomes quite the potent blender. Very nice. Fortunately, can't give him any other strats, and his aggressive friends have not gone to his aid. But he's just going to take all of his righteous litany of hates and pain and everything like and put them onto your terminators. Right, seven attacks. Yep. Misses you once, mm. but otherwise, quite a good start. Very happy with himself. Threes to wound you. Uh, That's quite good. Okay. That is five wounds. He's only minus one because I can't put one of the chapter on or anything like that. Two, what's the damage? Two. So you've killed one and a bit. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> That's fine. A righteous retribution for him, I believe. That's fine. Well, so that means there is... Wait, you killed two and a bit. No, one and a bit? One and a bit. One and one a bit. bit. Alright, I'm going to hit you back straight away. Yeah, that's fair. Okay? Yep. A cursed weapon. I'm doing my dark pact. Yep. For sustain. Sustain. I'll roll for them afterwards. <laughs> <laughs> About the end of this chaplain, but I wanted, him, I wanted him to go out this way rather than just being shot by something later on. I feel like this, is, this is how he would want it to go out. Four more hits for sustained. Yes. What's your toughness? Toughness four? Yes. Toughness four? Yep. Okay. Three to wound. Oh. Oh. <laughs> they don't like you. <laughs> Three, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven wounds. Minus two. Seven, eight, nine, ten. They're like, what are you doing? <laughs> Rosaria saves. Oh, he's not. He's not done very well there, has he? Oh no! What's the damage? Just damage one. Oh, he's 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 he's. he's Is he slain? He's dead and a half. Slain. Yeah. Oh well, he died as he lived in righteous fury. <laughs> <laughs> not bad turn. Not bad at all. I certainly needed that points wise. Um, I got overwhelming force and I got deploy teleport homer and I got a little bit of primary. So overall, I'm pretty happy with that. It is now over to you. Wow. 
Welcome to my turn three. It's nice to be here. And to you. Um, <laughs> I got Extend Battle Lines as my second uh, card, which initially I was like, that's big poo poo. But actually, it's all right. It's okay. Yeah. I've, adva I've done my movement as well. I've advanced over here with my uh, Hell Brute. Which is annoying, but it does mean I can get extend battle. Yes, and you and points do mean prizes. They ultimately. do indeed. Yeah. They do indeed. Um, I've moved up with my terminators over here to engage with the aggressors. I've moved up with the warp smith to be in the middle objective, and I've fallen back with my venom crawler again to be on the middle objective, which yeah. is important. You just fled. That's what we we need. To you be. will be able to shoot yourself because you didn't have to actually fall back. You just sort of run around that way. Oh, of course, so, it wasn't in combat, yeah. was he? Exactly. Well, I so back. I'll 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 I'll, I'll shut up. Um, the Oblitz have trundled forward as well with their tiny little four inch move, but now it's time to get into the shooting. Yes. We've done some stuff already. Yep. So the Watsmith has finally got to use his Eye of Siege. <laughs> um, you I got did, a CP. I did. Um, I, yeah, passed my leadership test, so I got a CP for the Eye of Siege when I did my um, Dark Pact. His guns did nothing, but he got me a CP, which I'm going to spend right now on. The stratagem I used earlier on, which I've forgotten the name of, which is called something. The cool guy okay, stratagem. I think that's what it is. Frame zeal. Re, re rocket some. I'm wounds. using. Popping smoke. smoke. Yeah. On the obliterators into that, which is popped smoke. I've done my defreeze already. I have four. Four shots. That's all I need. <laughs> <laughs> well, I've hit you every single time, and it is sustained. Sustained. So that's five times. <laughs> it makes my bones feel weird. It's forced to wound you. Yeah. Okay, couple of wounds, but we're re-rolling. It's three wounds. Three wounds at minus three, please. So I have got cover because of the smoke. <sighs> Did you pass it? Okay, good. Still alive. <laughs> Still alive. Somehow, yeah. Right, I've done the Venom Crawler off yeah. camera um, and did nothing to your aggressors, but I'm hoping my Terminators yeah, will do some combis. Combi bolters, first of all. Combi, combi, combi. Reroll the ones. Combi, 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 combi. Right, well, that's remarkably good. Three sustained. Three sustained. Three sustained. So now I just need fours for anti infantry. Better than last time, I hope. Is well, that is better than last time. Yes. That is much better than last time. That is uh, five mortal wounds. By what did you kill an aggressor? Oh, you killed two aggressors. Oh, very nice. Auto cannon of the Auto Reaper cannon. variety. I've hit you three times. Yes, indeed. Wounding on threes. I wound you two times. Minus something. Minus. Oh, it's just minus one. Oh. What's his damage? Uh, it's damage, damage, damage. Oh, it's just damage one. Oh, well, he's. He, he's got 11 wind. Nice. Charge face. Yeah. Terminates into your aggressors. Yep. Marvelous. He's very much in. Obliterators into your fleeing, flying tank. <laughs> yes. Yep. Lovely. Um, and I'm also going to do the Venom Crawler just to get out of line of sight of your big scary tank. Makes sense. Lovely. Very much in. Okay, cool. Let's move some stuff in. Here's the fight face. It is indeed. Here we go. Now, I've done my dark pacts uh, after my shooting phase, and I did lose a Terminator. You did? Because yeah. they failed. <laughs> yeah. Which is sad. So I've got four less attacks. To note, my captain's also putting only in death does duty end on his unit, because only death does duty end. And I can do it for free, because he's captain. That, nice. is, that is what happens. Um, OK, cool. So what I'm going to do is my, I'm going to do my power fist first, because he halves damage. So it doesn't matter if I'm... Well, it, that's only on the captain, that doesn't... Uh, the aggressor got one wound left. The aggressor right? got one wound left, yeah. Uh, I'm doing sustained yes. once again. On, 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 on them. Uh, can I wound you? I do wound you twice times. Um, the AP here. The AP is two. It's two. A powerful fist. Um, you do, you kill the aggressor. Yay! And now I've got my accursed weapon. This is all into the captain now. Ooh. What does he have? Um, he has six. Six? He's a chunky boy! Okay. Oh no, sustain, I missed you twice! Re rally. Uh. Okay. He's also right. tough for six. He's a oh, I can reroll my hits because I've done um, uh, a dark pact. Forgive me. Okay, well, I still miss you that time. Uh, I'll be wounding you. What's this? He's tough to six, right? Yeah, tough to oh, six. Oh, it's fives! Oh no, I've only done four wounds. I can't kill him. Four wounds? Yeah. Minus two. Minus two. Yep. Um, he saves two, but two go through. Okay. What's the damage on those? Just damage one. So, um, yeah, so he's taking two wounds. You've got four left. <laughs> right, so my aggressor obviously has been killed, but gets to fight on death, because only in death does duty end. Yeah. That just goes off. 
Yeah, because why do I have to do it on a four plus? Well, well yours is one command point change. Mine's two, but because I'm using it on a captain, I'm doing it for free. It's a yeah, bit cheeky. It's once per battle round, it's fun yes. doing it. It's a special thing. Imagine if they meant more aggressors. That's yeah. annoying. <laughs> <laughs> uh, we well, only hits you once. Okay. So it kind of evens it out, really, doesn't it? He does wound you though. You've wounded me. Minus two. Uh, yes. Two damage now. So he's, he's, he's punched you right there. Um, and then the captain will now fight as well. Okay. Um, his power fist. A fighty captain. Oh, ideal. Okay, it's a power fist. He might as well to be hit. Oh. Um, to wound you. Hit him. He wounds you. You're to strength five. Only wounds you once. <gasps> Just the one wound. Minus two. <laughs> You do Jump kill him. Now he does have his two bonus attacks. Oh, go away! <laughs> he only hits you once with that. Oh, that's exciting. Do it with the really bleed! It does wound you! 83? Minus. I think it's only minus two. two. Oh, he's two. fine. He's fine. There you go. He's fine. Oh, it's fun, isn't it? <laughs> My Venom Crawler has done nothing. No. Which is fine. But the Obliterators fine. hopefully will do something. Oh, that's exciting! I've done another dark pack for sustained. Oh, look at all those twos. Look at all those twos. I do get an extra hit there, though, so that's fine. I'm in your threes, right? Yes. It is fives to wound you, though. <sighs> Come on! <gasps> Come on! Oh! Okay. Three sixes. Oh, that's the minus hit. The minus is two. <laughs> that's savage. Two. <laughs> yes! Yes! <laughs> Blow up! Do I explode? Take my venom crawler with you. Ah, oh. very oh, really good. Right, Poor, it's close, isn't it? <laughs> it's um, I've got both cars. Yeah, down well done, dude. Lines. Thank you very much. Um, yes, it's all about the middle now because yeah, he's going to start moving away. <laughs> I'm going to wet my pants. <laughs> yeah, I don't get any primary, um, so I'll have a look at what secondaries I get and see what I can do. You join us at the end of the movement phase. Um, so cards wise, I got capture enemy outpost and then I got behind enemy lines, but I had to spend a CP to redraw so I got attempting target because I can't actually get two units behind enemy lines, which is very frustrating. I didn't get attempting target, which is a tricky one, which you've allocated the one onto the Terminators. Yeah. And it gets better with a bad bunch because it's always E5, the repulsor, which is quite yeah. nice. Um, so movement wise, I've moved up the repulsor, fell back with the captain, and then the um, Inceptors have just moved onto the objective to get that for sort of banked me, capture on me outpost, which is yeah. very, very nice. Now, I said to you what I need to try and do is try and kill these terminators so I can get tempting targets yeah. and potentially make a charge. Yeah. So I'm gonna do some shooting, we'll yeah. have to see how it goes. It's been a very mixed bag, this. Um so the repulse is completely whiffed, basically. It really has. Um done nothing to the terminators. Um I think oh no, it did two damage. Did I've got two, a one yeah. on the damage for the um laser talent. So yeah. uh, you're so unlucky there. with your rerolls. Just, just the way it goes sometimes. Um, he is holding the center for what it's worth, but yes. obviously I'm not getting tempting target. I have then shot with my plasma over here at your um, hell brute. Yes. Um, I did get seven wounds through because they're twin only, linked. Only seven. <laughs> only seven. I am supercharging, so we'll have to see how it goes. I think. Oh, you've absolutely. Yeah, the three damage a pop. Oh, does he explode? And do I explode? Hey! He does explode. Hey! One more to win. Oh, okay. But so do one you then the just die, James? Yeah, I need to then see if I... D how many... Oh, just... hazard. Two die! Two, pop. There you go. Pop, pop! They yeah, popped. Nice. That's yeah. very exploding. That was it. Uh, yes, uh, that's pretty much my turn. Okay. I do get capture enemy outpost, but I don't get a tempting target. Big eight points over there, though. Big eight points, though, yeah. Will you discard tempting target for a command point? So do they, you, the, uh, yes, because that doesn't that disappear next turn. Uh, uh, yes. yes. Yeah, so that's going. I'll go get my command point. <laughs> Okay, a couple of things happened. Yep. <laughs> so <laughs> we've got to charge with the tank over there into the watersmith so you can get closer into the middle. Yes, because I'm trying to block off you getting as much onto the objective as possible. Yes. I didn't have any points for tank shock, which was very sad. I wasn't mm. going to run over your watersmith. Yep. But you didn't kill him. Didn't kill him. And then I got greedy. Yeah, you did. So <laughs> I did my dart pact, as I always do, uh, uh, just to try uh, uh, and do as uh, much damage as possible because I have to kill it yeah, you this do. time you to do. try and get that back. Um, unfortunately, I did fail my leadership test on the old. Uh, <laughs> oh, no. there. You did do two wounds through it, though. You did do two wounds, though. Wounds. I did do two Softened wounds. him up considerably. Um, I don't know if I get a CP for. Can you do your little. Uh, each time it takes a dart pact, it, it's a new battle round. So if I, let me just pass my leadership test first. So that will give me another. This for the new bat. Uh, no, I fail. I fail that. So I don't, don't even get my CP. No. Now, I need to see if he dies because I failed my leadership for my dark pack. So I take D three more. He's got two wounds. left. I need a one or a two. So he's low on a wound. 
<laughs> okay, in terms of my movement, I've moved away from the ejector over there with my terminators. I've moved forwards with my um, obliterators over there to move towards the middle. Yeah. I've gone a bit mad and I've advanced over there with my venom crawler because he's very speedy to try and yes. get onto that rear objective because I drew capture enemy outpost and investigate signals. So the plan is to um, not be eliminated in your next turn and then move on to that to get eight points in my next turn. Very well. Uh -huh. <laughs> Right, Ooh. so we've done three wounds onto Mr. Captain down here. He has one wound left, which is really annoying. <laughs> That's fine. One thing we forgot to do is that in the movement phase, the Watsif would have done his enraged, um, uh, uh, enraged machine spirits onto your repulsor there. Yes! You need to do a battle shock test, which could be important. Oh! You're fine. Yeah, you're fine. You're fine. You're fine. He's fine. He's okay. He's so okay. I mean you couldn't do any stratagems. <laughs> <laughs> so the Warsmith's still in combat, but he does have pistol tendrils. So um, I am... Oh, I'm not going to overcharge. Maybe I should. What's his OC? OC1. He's OC1, the obliterators are OC2, which means if he, if that tank is alive and the obliterators are there, you're contesting it. Uh, what, what's your OC? Five. Yes. Oh, bum. Okay. I won't be um, OCing then. Uh, I do a bit, a bit uh, uh, overcharging. Plasma <laughs> pistol! I do hit you, plasma pistol. I do not wound you. The melter tendril. <laughs> oh, my melter tendril uh, is pistol. It is a wound. But no, I am armor of contempting because I'm obviously minus one to hit because I'm in combat already. Yeah, so it's so. minus four. Minus four. So it'll be minus three. So it'll be six up save. Okay. Goes through. So it's D3 it plus two. <laughs> Oh, that's five. Oh, that's no. five. Oh, oh. Uh, you're away. You're off to the races. I've got my flamer. Flamer tendril. One flamer. No, never mind. Okay. Uh, okay. Well, not a bad start. Not, not a bad, bad start. start. Good. This is uh, going good. I'm going to go straight into my obliterators. Do it. And straight onto them. So I'm doing my dart pack. Full sustained, of course. Uh, how many shots do I get with my big boomer guns? Four. It's the same as last time, but not worse. <laughs> uh -huh. Oh, and I'm doing profane zeal for... Yeah, if you rewrite. Yeah, basically. Yes. Yeah. So I'll be forced to hit you. Okay, two hits so far, one sustained. Oh, it's pretty good going, that. Ooh, two sustained. Uh, Fours to wound you. Rerolling. Ooh. 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 Oh, oh no. Yeah, with the rerolls, it's five saves. Five wounds. These are at minus. What, you, what is it? I've got like a five up save. Minus three. So minus two. But minus two. Oh, he's very dead. He's dead. Oh, he's so dead. <laughs> Does he explode? He's finally dead. He doesn't oh. explode. Oh, oh. There we go. Oh boy. <laughs> <laughs> so um, uh, no secondaries. I'm going to uh, capture my outpost. I can hopefully get my next turn. Yeah, uh, you should investigate signals. I'm going to discard for a CP. Nice. Um, and in the next turn, all of the objectives are going apart from the middle. Exactly. Ex yeah, except for the middle. It's very close on the on the points. I see, I, basically, we're coming down to what cards I can get. Yeah. So. Now. You can do it now. Do it now. Oh, do it now. Man. Do it now. Right. No prisoners. Okay. Investigate signals. Ooh. Right, so let's have a think. Mm. <sighs> okay, so essentially, it's all, it's all gone mad. It's all gone <laughs> mad. There's an outside chance. Yeah. Well, there's like a, a chance I can force a draw. Yeah. But it does require me to literally kill everything in the middle. Yeah. I do weirdly have the assets to do so. Um, because I can advance with the Inceptors and their assault weapons, I can deal with the Obliterators. In theory, I might be able to finish the stuff in the middle. Yes. But you have, quite cleverly, after I've done elected to Overwatch. I'm going to do an Overwatch with my Obliterators. I'm going to go for the Ruinous Salvo. I only got five on my 2d6, but it's better than nothing. Yep. I've gone for Sustain again. Okay. Because, of course. <laughs> Sixes. <laughs> Right, I can remark my ones oh, because yeah. they are. Oh no, nothing. Oh god, okay. nothing. Oh, the stress is that real? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so weirdly, despite no matter what the interceptors do, they have the potential to kill stuff. I can charge, kill the terminates. The captain has to kill the warpsmith now. Because if I can't kill him, then you can hold the objective. The interceptors can't see the ability to get in range and see the warpsmith. Mm. He's got four shots. Mm. I'm doing storm of fire, so I'm ignoring cover. I won't be getting extra AP because I'm not in Devastated Doctrine, but essentially I've just got to try and kill the Warp Smith. I've done Infernal Rites to reduce your AP by one because you've done the ignore cover thing, right? Yes, yeah. <sighs> <laughs> Do you miss you once? Okay. Oh, James, what's your Oath of Moment target? The Warp Smith, I'm The Warp Smith, yeah. yeah. <laughs> 
Pete all the time. All right. Falls to Winji. Free rolling. All right. He wins you three times. Three wins. Right. AP one. Yep. So but AP obviously you're ignoring that AP. So he's got so two, two up saves. saves. She's not rolling one. She's <laughs> <laughs> not rolling one. <laughs> oh, you done it! <laughs> What well done! What a game! Oh my oh. god! <laughs> I am absolutely exhausted. That Everything was wild. That happened was so important. From turn one, <laughs> yeah, it was just like immediately <laughs> stressful. Um, right. So just yeah. to be super clear, yes, because um, uh, he because he can't be targeted by the uh, inceptors because they can't see. Him. Yeah. So that means that um, holding the centre objective means that I'll get fifteen points at the end of my turn. Yes which can't be stopped. Yeah, I can't stop it, because the theory was, if I could kill him, which yeah. was quite arguably possible with the um, captain, I could then, between charges and the plasmas, deal with the rest of the middle, which would get me enough points and no prisoners to offset the fact that you would get this, you would get capture on the outpost in your turn. Well, that would, that would make it evens, would force a draw, and then yeah. if, depending on what Beard scored as his second secondary. Yeah. Should I see what it was? Yeah, see what it was. It was no prisoners. But then you'd only have the venom have him there. there. So essentially, he'd, he'd, yeah, over he'd go, blah, 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 blah. So uh, but ultimately not killing the warp smith means no, even if I annihilate these, the rest of it, yeah. I can't charge the warp smith. I can't get close enough to do anything else to deal with him. Yeah. Because the issue, other issue was I could have moved closer to potentially do a charge, but then I was running the risk of you just overwatch him with the obliterators. And he's only got a wound left. Yeah. So that was way too risky. Well, that, that was the plan, but then they came over and I was like, I'll go for them. <laughs> um, oh, what a game, man. That was amazing. Was crazy. Wowie. Well, well done for killing my Lord of Skulls. Well done for him killing lots of other stuff. That was the main objective, I think. That was the main objective. Well done for not killing him in turn one and making me sad. <laughs> yeah, that, would have, that would have been lame. <laughs> also, I did need to deal with the land raid as well. That was a big problem. Yeah. Because um, it kind of kept my other tanks safe. I forgot about the land raid. <laughs> yeah, that was turn one. That was oh, many, many moons ago. Um, uh, yeah, I really like the dragons. There's so much depth to space marines. Like, I've got so many options. There's so many ways of running them. Aggressors are great. Um, I think the bikes are amazing. Yes. Especially with the um, the enhancement and catches and fire combo it makes them quite nasty in a dev doctrine. Yep. Um, the Inceptors are surprisingly interesting because they're more resilient than you'd expect. Yeah. You're more likely to kill yourself than you are. They're a lot less killy now, but they are yes, still good. really annoying. Um, and they're still really annoying to deal with. And also being able to deep track within three of something is pretty gnarly as well. Um, but how did you find running your beloveds? Oh, it's the best. It's my favourite. My favourite. Lord, uh, Lord of Skulls can stay. He won't be sent back. Yeah, he's great. <laughs> he's lots of fun. Yeah, he's loads of fun. Not to take him every game, but he is a quarter yeah, of my army. It's quite so hard, yeah. Gonna, maybe I won't take him next time, but I probably will. Yeah, probably will. Well, thank you for the game. Thank you for the game. Thank you for watching. Thank you for being here with us today. What an absolute treat. Oh, that was man. a lot of fun. Thank you to our servo skull. Boop, 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 boop. Oh! It's been a long day. Oh, it's been a long day. 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 <laughs> so, yes, we'll, we'll, yeah, we'll, yeah, yeah, that's the end. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> <laughs>